Squad, this is Monica and I have something to show you today from one of my new friends at artdot.com. They sent me this beautiful container. It's actually multiple containers that can hold small little pieces of your crafting supplies. And this is, I think, meant for diamond painting folks who like to use the little teeny tiny pieces, like the rhinestone-y looking pieces to make the artwork and everything. This is the nine drawer storage. And this is really cool because it's multifunctional. And you know me, I'm all about multifunctional, multi-use, all that kind of good stuff. This is something that's really super handy. Even if you don't craft, maybe you, your husband, he has screws and bolts and nuts and everything all over the garage. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe he has some things, you know, in the man verse that he needs to have organized. This would be perfect for them. So ArtDot.com reached out to me and offered to send me this beautiful nine drawer stackable storage. And it has a bunch of round bottles in each drawer. Look at that, pulls all the way out. Look at all of these bottles. Let's see how many, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So 32 bottles in each drawer and they slide in there. But that isn't the only thing that's cool about this. This has so many features that I completely adore because not only do you just have a ton of bottles, I think it's like 288 bottles are in this, but you have labels that you can write and put on your drawers or your actual bottles. You have this cute little funnel. It's actually something that expands. So <laughs> when you want to drop your little beads, into the bottles which actually screw open it's not just a pull off top which i really like that because if it screws on there's less opportunity for accident so to speak so you just unscrew that and then you pop your funnel down in there pour your stuff in there until it fills up your bottle then you just screw the lid back on put that back in your drawer and then when you're done doing all that you can just fold up your little funnel again put that away or keep that on top however you're going to have that so i mean look at this nine drawers worth of 32 bottles each 288 bottles can you imagine the possibilities here <laughs> that gets my blood pumping and makes me a little warm y'all yeah i know it's exciting isn't it i know i know, I know. I'll, I'll let i'll let you have a moment right <laughs> but <laughs> that isn't all the cool factor about this having all of these bottles and all of these drawers but wait there's more. We have three drawers in each row. This will also be able to come apart. Now, I am not any kind of technical whiz, so just bear with me. So you can push these. I don't know that you can see what I'm doing here. You can push these forward. They, they attach in the little grooves here. So you can push a box forward and you can actually separate them from each other individually. So see how this is coming back? Now once you've pushed them back, it seems to have a stopping point on the lip there. But you can actually pull this all the way off and hope that you don't drop everything like I'm probably fixing to do. And this is where, I don't know, you know, for me, it wouldn't be something that I could probably take apart I can't ever seem to put things back together once I've taken it apart. And you know me and jewelry making, I don't like to ever take anything apart, right? I like to put things together. So anyway, I have now scooched this front forward in order to take that top row off. But I can also then take each individual drawer off and do that for each one. So you get nine individual drawers, right? Nine drawers full of the 32 bottles or you can have these stacked together okay ah that was easy so this is the fat part of the groove on the other drawer you just find the inner groove on the other drawer and then slide that all the way down and it is back in place same thing with the tops once you've got it all put back together which i finally did because you know it was easy right then you just go and find from the front section and it's it's just a like a tongue and groove situation so once you have gotten those into the spot then you can just slide it back into place and it stops on the back there okay so trust me if i can put that back together 
it, it's easy. And this is the first time I've even touched it. I just opened the box and came on here to film this for you because I have something else. I actually purchased something else from Art Dot, and I'll be showing you that in a different video. Although I filmed it first because I, I got it first before I got this. <laughs> So my hair and everything's gonna look different in that video. You'll just have to uh, disregard that. But anyway, here we go. <laughs> so something else that's cool is, yes, there's still more. I know, it's exciting. So I'm gonna pick this up. I'm gonna turn it around and show you the back of these. Now you, you might be wondering, what are all these little holes and everything? Well, that is so that you can hang these. I know excitement right so not only can you just individually have these drawers tucked away wherever you might need them or you might have them all attached per row like three to a row you might want to have all nine of them attached in a single level like a single tier however but maybe you've got a situation that you need to hang them hang them up on a wall Right here you go, guys. Right here you go. So that's really exciting. Now, this would work great, like my husband's garage, okay? He doesn't he doesn't want this stuff sitting on a table. Not that there's any table space in his area because it's all about tools there. But he can hang these on the wall, and then he can just pull out the drawers that he needs in order whatever he's going to do to organize his bottles and things like that. So, I mean, that's awesome for him. For me, here in my office, I could probably actually hang some right here on this wall that's behind me because I have you know seed beads bits and bobs gemstones precious stones that maybe i've got like bead soup left over and i might want to color coordinate them or whatnot so i can do that very easily and hang them on my wall to get them up and off of any table space um, issues that i might have so you know that's that's awesome so i'm going to turn this back around now something else that i like which you haven't really seen is they have these labels but they've got these little clear cellophane pieces that are on the top so that I can write whatever I want to write or print however you want to do it make your own labels on this little label and then have it protected so it does not get yucky fied wherever I'm going to have this especially if you're going to put it in the garage with your husband because you know that is a little bit precarious isn't it they fit easily in there and then you just put the little film on top slide it in the little nook there i mean they thought of everything really and then of course you can label whatever is going to be in these bottles as you fill them up if you want to do it by color if you want to do it by whatever it is um the items if you're like me and you make jewelry and you want to have it by jewelry making supplies i mean you know it's an endless array of possibilities I know y'all are excited to go over to artdot.com and check out this common painting stackable storage unit. If you don't need all of these drawers, they've got them in different counts. I'm just so excited. I'm, I'm running hot. <laughs> So if you want to check out the ArtDot.com website, because I know you will, I will have my affiliate links below. And then also, ArtDot has given me a coupon code so that you get 10% off of your order, as well as free shipping. So that's awesome. They have a lot of different options here for this stackable storage for the diamond painting accessories. You can get that in a one, a two, a four, or a nine drawer unit okay i mean look at that nine drawers full of those bottles things they really put a lot of thought into this so i like also the fact that you get a little bit more freedom of movement with the drawers if you just want to take out like maybe all of these have blue beads in them right and i think oh yeah i think i only want to work in blues today like what i'm wearing here so i'm just going to work in blues today i pull this out and it travels with me either here on my table or you know wherever i'm going to go and then i just put it right back in whenever i'm done so this this is something that I think a lot of y'all will enjoy and the prices are extremely reasonable. Now I have been given this from artdot.com and I'm so appreciative. Thank you again for doing that. This is a beautiful opportunity for you all that have <laughs> a lot of crafting supplies like I do. And then also I am a jewelry maker so I've got a lot of little bitty pieces. This is going to be something really handy for me. Make sure that you use my 10% off coupon code with the free shipping and that is going to be SBM10. That's Sparkle by Monica. SBM10. That gets you 10% off with free shipping for whatever your purchase will be at artdot.com. Again, I'll have my affiliate links below and then I will also put uh, the link to this specific unit and then also, I'm going to be showing you a video. Now, keep in mind, I did I did actually film that video beforehand because I purchased that and I got it quicker. But, I'll give you a sneak peek right now. 
Look at this. This beautiful pink and blue case, guys. I am so excited about it. So I've got a separate video for that. This is an item that I purchased myself. I took these two apart so that you can see it a little bit better. Of course, I took the bottles out. The drawer, my drawer of bottles are laying down here so that I don't have anything to break. But I've got the backs with the holes. Now that is gonna be facing me. But you can see on the tops, they have those little indentations. Same thing on the bottom. And then on the sides, so all around, they've got everything already thought out so that you can put these together. Okay, so now what you have to think about is that the side that has uh, the protruding panel, the side that has the indented panel, that is what is like the tongue and groove scenario. So you're going to start from either the front or back. I think I'm going to go from the front. So you're going to just take the tongue and the groove, line it up to where it catches that little slide, and then just slide it together. Now it's, it stops itself, but I'm pulling. So then if I want to just have two of these together, I can do that. It's whatever I want to do. Now this one is still loose, so I'm just going to find this side that is pooched up match it up to the indentation on this. Okay, there it goes. Very easy. And then in order to get back on to the previous row, I just have to come to the front again like I did. But this is a tongue and groove from the top side. And then I'm just sliding that back in there. Easy. It'll take some time if you're challenged like I am, you know, maybe a few minutes of kind of playing around with it some in order to get that slid back into place. So this is really an awesome unit. And again, come back because I will show you the item that I got that is the, the case, which is extra awesome for my purposes of being able to teach classes. I can actually just take that case with me and not have to worry about all the menagerie of things that I usually take with me. Everything can go in that case. So I'm looking forward to showing you that. So thanks again to artdoc.com. Please check them out via my affiliate links that I have below in my video description. So I do appreciate those of you who are supporting me in my video descriptions and my blog posts. That's so nice of you. Thank you so much. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and share below in the comments. What is your favorite way to store your crafting supplies? Do you, are you a diamond painting artist? This would be right up your alley. If you've not already subscribed to my channel, please do so and share this with any of your jewelry making friends or crafting aficionados that might be interested in this. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a sparkle day, y'all. Bye!